This is a moray valve. You can see the intense energy interactions that are happening. The bubble formation and the amperage swings. Two aluminum electrodes. The aluminum electrodes are in metamict quartz with some nanotechnology. The moray detector is putting out quite a bit of amperage and bubbles. We're now going to test it, see how it does. It's not putting out too much in millivolts. Millivolts is actually kind of low. Oh, now there we go. It's increasing. As well as the bubbling. A TH Mori cell uses radioisotopes in order to create the electrical effect. TH Mori's diodes were able to uh, enable him to light up quite a bit of light bulbs. In metamict quartz, there's trace elements of radioisotopes, so we've used metamict quartz powder here and some nanotechnology to boost it. It's creating a lot of bubbles. The quartz is reacting. This is quartz, water, and aluminum electrodes with nanotech. Bubbles are increasing and increasing. The temperature of the cell is also rising. 